It's beer o'clock on Reload Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Monio in Budapest and it's a bottle of this Sour Rise. It's a Maracuja Sour Saison coming in at 5.9% ABV. I really like the artwork on the label. It looks absolutely tremendous. Uh, you can see it's a hazy beer, hazy Saison through the, through the bottle. Uh, there's a look at their bottle cap. Many, many thanks to Zoltan for sending me these beers from Croatia, uh, from from Hungary, I should say. And he spat out Croatia then, but Hungary, I promise you, Hungary. Let's get the beer out into a glass. See what we get. Woo! Nice bit of smoke on the bottle opening. Beer in the glass then. Can you hear that? Have a listen guys. Rigorous pour. Have a listen. It's the, it, for me it's a characteristic of a sour beer. If you get that big kind of, give it a bit of a rigorous pour. Be careful though, you don't want to spill it everywhere out the, out the glass. Give it a bit of a rigorous pour. Let the head rise to about 10 mil. And then have a listen. If it dissipates really quickly, it's a good characteristic for a sour beer. Sour beers very rarely hold their head for whatever scientific reason that is. I don't know myself. Comment in the comments box. If you know this, you know more than me. Let me know why the head psh, hisses and fizzes away very quickly with a sour beer. Sour saison, should I say. It's got good carbonation. It is a hazy light, very light straw coloured beer. Let's get the aroma. It's unfiltered, I don't think it's bottle conditioned. Aroma. Oh, 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 oh. Wow, 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 wow. That is bonkers, bonkers sour, that one. Really full on powerful sour beer. Wow, incredible. But lots of like apricot and mango and can, like a peel, like an orange peel, satsuma peel. It smells incredibly sour in the best possible way. Thank you very much Zoltan, let's dive in. Cheers everybody. Oh. oh wow, boom, Stone the Crows, Stone the Crows, what an amazing tasting beer, super, super sour, blows your palate to bits, wow, 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 um, but it is so, you, yeah, you get that kind of biscuity, wheat flavour, as soon as the sourness, it kind of, it kind of like rips a hole in your palate. And it, and it lets this kind of like sweet, biscuity, malty, wheaty flavour come through straight after this, instinctively after. But then, but then after that, it's like it's been dry hopped and there's all these kind of, kind of like orange flavours coming through and maybe some pineapple and mango and passion fruit flavours bursting through on the palate. <laughs> Carbonation's huge. It bursts, it explodes, it sends the beer all around the inside of the mouth. Wow. Oh my goodness me. Such a sour beer. Such a sour beer, but it's, it's enough. It gives you a massive smile. I really, really like this style of beer, this sour kind of big bowl flavour hit. It's a smack really, it's a, it's a huge smack of a flavour that hits you on the palate. But then I like that kind of longing flavour afterwards of, of, of mango and passion fruit. Really kind of, yeah, it's an orange peel flavour that just seems to go on for a, such a long time. What a wonderful beer, so it's kind of like it's like Jacqueline Hyde. It's totally like Jacqueline Hyde. 
um, Jackal being the complete sourness to begin with and then this beautiful kind of like dry hop finish on the back end that yeah it's really tasty really tasty um, yeah and I love that artwork look at that you can see the little monster there with some sourness coming up the side of his of his mouth well cool well cool uh, so it's all in Hungarian uh, they've, they, it looks like they're from Budapest um, yeah I can't read any of it which is a bit of a shame but maybe if you want to put if you're reading this in Hungary uh, if you want to pause the video have a look have a read that'd be cool uh, I'm gonna rate it Monyo Budapest uh, probably my new favorite brewery from from Budapest uh, from Hungary should I say the beer that beer is crazy good crazy good looks good smells good tastes good let's dive in let's rate it even still sour uh, that beer is incredible absolutely kind of just like mind-blowing beer so much going on so much going from from the moment the beer hits your lips to like a good minute after you is like this whole beer window of flavor hitting you hitting you and hitting you for me it's a stone the crows 10 out of 10 it's a 10 out of 10 beer from real Ale craft beer please put your comments in the comments box subscribe to our daily beer and food reviews give us a big fat thumbs up boom and cheers